March forecast. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way, okay? And please take note that this is only a general reading. If this doesn't resonate with you, please check out your moon risings. Let's take a look. Hmm. Oh. Wow, this is going to be a very good month for you. It seems like you're going to be having both um, the finances and then love in some single Scorpios. Okay. Um, that are not yet married. We'll be receiving like an engagement ring or a proposal. Okay. Let's take a look at your finances. I'll be pulling out more cards later on, okay? Um, after I'm done with all this spread. It seems like this is going to be a very special month for you. Mm. You're trying to save for something big. Let's take a look at your love life. from an air sign who's coming your way. Let's take a look at your sex life. You know, some Scorpios actually have a choice of three. Single Scorpios, okay? And those who are not yet in a serious relationship and if you're just having some fun with, you know, some casual hookups or something like that. You are trying to make a choice between the three, air, earth, and fire. Well, there's actually a water, but it doesn't really appeal to you much. The fire is actually a spontaneous one. The earth is the uh, relationship material one. And... The uh, the ear sign. I feel like this one is um, financially stable, but for you, it's like you want more. But just be very careful in ending up with someone who's a sadist. Okay, let's take a look at your life purpose. Oracle cards, practice, crystals. All right, Scorpio. Let's pull out more clarifications on this. Okay. It seems like somebody around you is wearing a mask. Okay. Or you are the one who's actually wearing a mask and, uh, you know, making it appear in front of other people that you're already okay. You know, um, having whatever, you know, being happy, whatever you have right now. But at this point or at this moment, you're looking for more changes. And definitely something big is coming in your way. Okay, something major, major changes or major move. Now, uh, there will also be a change of your status, okay? Um, single Scorpios will be receiving a proposal or like an engagement, okay? Now, married Scorpios... There is a possibility that either your relationship will going will be going through um like an entire transition or 
altogether you'll be choosing freedom if you feel like it's not really you know like um it can't be helped anymore especially if you're with an air sign right now okay there are a lot of things that you feel like you know that could be a mo could be more of a reason for you to hold on to this relationship but then if you will just calculate you know the the, the times that's about to come and uh, the pain that will be weighed with it as well you feel like it's much better for you to let go of each other but then don't um don't rush into any decision okay don't um don't make any hasty decisions at this point especially if you are a little bit emotionally you know drained and uh, all over the place because I feel like there is a possibility or there's still a big chance for the two of you to really survive this relationship. It's just that the two of you are not really talking. Now, finances. Some Scorpios will be receiving an inheritance or there is an unexpected money that will be coming from an unexpected resource. Either it's a government, an insurance or like a, a form of like an agency or a government branch. Okay. And you'll be very surprised that this amount of money is, you know, something that you really need for you to start a new beginning, to start a new life, or to start a new business. Because you're trying to raise the money that you really need for the business or for the investment that you're thinking, you know, right now. I'm so sorry for my voice, okay? If, um, if, uh, um, I have to pause for a, for a little while. Anyway. Um, I think I have an allergy. Anyway, money will be very light this month, and like what I said, that there will that there will be a big you know big change, major transition. That includes um, a transfer to a new place, new area, a move to a new house or a new environment, or it could be a new company as well. Okay. Now. Now, you will also be traveling by the end of this month or the last week of this month, okay, to a place where your family lives or to a place where you actually grew up. Now, you will be walking away over a situation that you feel like it no longer serves you well. And I feel like you will also be sacrificing a bit, especially if there is a friendship that you feel like is a little bit dysfunctional or toxic. Now you, you know, upon your travel, it's more of a mix of business and uh, pleasure, okay? Now, the travel that you will be making, I feel like either it's connected to your job or it is connected to an investment or business that you're thinking about or that you want to check out. But either way, you are making a very big step and you're already in the right path this month. Now, let's take a look at your finances, it seems like you are trying to save up for something or you're trying to keep your your money okay intact and you are trying to save your money for something that you really wanted to have to buy to invest or to really s to make a brand new beginning okay the good thing about you Scorpio is that you're good at making money but sometimes you also have a problem controlling your spending, especially if there is something that you really want. And then you will just think that, oh, I can borrow this or I can just take a loan here, take a loan there. You know, that right before your salary comes, it's already gone. But this month, you will be making some, you know, some new changes, good and positive changes that you feel like, while I'm, you know, while I'm at it or while I'm still young or while I'm still earning this much, I want to save something for my future so that I can have a, like a better retirement someday. And it's not just about <coughs> investing in a business. I feel like you will also be thinking more about the future, okay? For a future stability, whether you already have a family or you're still single. But... You just want to prepare for your, you know, for your future. And you are making a very huge positive change into your life right now. You're slowly growing up and you're, al you're already maturing. Now, 
And you know what? This, what's the good thing about this is that money will just come to you easily from different angles, from different corners, and you won't have any problem with it. Okay? Now, when it comes to your love life, news from, from an air sign that is coming rapidly. Okay? And you feel like you want to think things over. Because you don't even know if this person is really, you know, um, really sincere or they are just trying to save up the, the, their face or their, their reputation for losing you. Because they know that the, you know, you know that you're, you're only like a, you know, like a decoration in their life and, and they don't really, f you know, seem that they are really in love with you. And... I feel like there will be a big talk, okay? And not to mention that you will feel that this person is not being true to you and lying to you as well. So be very careful with air signs, okay? Especially if this person is somebody from the past. Because I feel like this person is only, only wants you for their own benefit and not because that they really love you. Okay. Some Scorpios will also have some problems, okay? Whether you're already married or not. You will have some problems with somebody that you're with right now. Um, sexually. They're going to have some ED. Or you are the one who's going to have some ED. Erectile dysfunction. Okay? Um, you will feel insulted at first. Or this person will somehow feel uh, degraded because of what's been happening to them. But then, I feel like both of you are looking for some new adventures and more thrill, okay? And not to mention that the other person are, you know, they're too selfish that whenever they want you, they want you. Whenever you want them, they're not available. So it's kind of a one-way thing. But what's happening right now is that I feel like medically, something is go going on or happening into your partner's life or into your partner's thing. Okay, so you better go and check out with your doctor. Now, there is somebody who will be coming, you know, in the form of a temptation, that this person will come and quench your thirst when it comes to your sex life, your drying and, and, and dying sex life. And I feel like even though you're going to try and fight the urge not to go for this person, you feel like it's been like a long, long while. Okay, but please... Don't ever cross the line. Whatever happens, sometimes it's only like the form of a universe or the form of life to test if you're really strong enough for the big reward later on. I'm pretty sure that you're, you know, you have enough self-discipline to resist this temptation of yours or this temptation that's going to be coming your way. And you will soon be rewarded, okay? If you are going to give in to this person, you know that it's not really going to, pan out well not to mention it's actually not permitted and you know what will be the uh, the karma okay or what will be the consequences of this now when it comes to your health colds flu um influenza okay body ache body pain muscle pain um some pain in your groin and unusual smell in your body because of your because of your stress or something like you know like an exotic thing that you have tried a few days weeks or or nights ago and now it's coming out of your system okay plus don't self-medicate it's not really um good for you now you you know some scorpius will also be under a lot of depression because of the things that's been happening going on in their love life and as much as they want to take care of themselves they feel like they also needed somebody to take care of them but that is codependency okay it's much better for you to go and take care of yourself be whole and be happy on your own because you can only find it from within not from other people and it is much better for you to go and spend some time in the water or near the water now when it comes to your life purpose you usually get your answers and your you know some helpful insights through oracle card readers and you also have some interest in reading cards now there's like a like um 
special or pertaining hobby of yours and you just need to hone your skills and you will be making a big change to this you know more likely to stand as an inspiration to those people who also have the same talent as yours and get more in touch with your earth element or earth side okay now let's take a look go and collect some more crystals it will help you let's take a look at your oracle cards Freedom, awareness, heart healing. Now, since that you will be feeling a little bit down and depressed this month, there is, you know, something that your spirit guides that will do to heal you and make you feel better. And there will also be some awareness that will be raised, you know, for you to find more solution, to have more clear intuition, clear head and clear insight into the situation. And... Free yourself from worries, anxiety, and toxicity, okay? Because if you will be putting this first before you, then you will never have any clear answer to your questions. Now, anyway, that's it for you for this month, Scorpio. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.